Good day everybody, welcome to Leanna James uh, live episode tonight. Tonight we're going to talk about a little bit about body in the hair. So I'm going to give you a few little tricks on mm -hmm. how you can best get body in the hair. I'm going to show you some products like our wonderful Absorb by De Lorenzo. We've got some Sandstorm here. We've also got some Densify, pretty cool stuff. We've also got some salt. Now it's quicksand, right? You'll be able to see it come through hopefully there. Okay. And for those blokes out there that have a, a volume problem, we've also got some thickening spray and I'll explain that a little bit later on. But what we hear often in the salon is that people struggle to get some body. So you can see our wonderful dolly here, and I've done this on purpose. She's got really, really flat hair, okay? Now, if you've been parting your hair consistently on this side of your head, then the likelihood is potentially you might lose a little bit of that volume, okay, over time. It gets used to being parted where it is. You're probably woken up in the morning and just seeing that it parts exactly where it should have parted in the sense that it's been there for so long, it's gonna part in exactly this position. Now, one very, very easy trick to all of a sudden change the way you look, but also change that outcome, is just change the part to the other side, okay? So, if you grab the hair and just flip it instantaneously to the other side, you will see that you'll get some body created straight away. You don't have to do anything, okay? All you have to do is literally change the parting from one side to the other, and you'll get that body sitting in the hair instantaneously, okay? Now, the other option that you have is that you put some product in the hair, okay? So if it's sitting too flat and you just, it's right on the head like that, it's as flat as, right? You need to try to get some product in there. Now, we have a few different options. Now, if those that have really oily hair, g'day Lucy, those that have really oily hair, um, and you might need to get rid of some of your oil. So, I'm gonna give an example of how Absorb works. Now, I'm gonna use a little bit of oil balance and pop it onto my skin. I'm gonna to try to put it on your, on your camera there so you can see it, all right? It's quite oily. You'll even see it on my finger, very oily stuff. Now, the Absorb, you just spray it once, spray it tight, and you saw how much I had put on there, okay, gone. All right, it really absorbs it really quite well and quite amazing. You'll also note, notice that there's no white residue on my skin or when you're using it on your hair, on your hair. And you just spray that into the problem areas. So if you've got oil towards the front, spray it in that front section. If you have oil in different parts of, the sec of your hair, spray it in those sections, okay? Very, very simple solution to helping with oil problems is a little bit of your Absorb. G'day Stella. Oh, sorry, g'day Stacy, I should say. All right, make sure you're putting it into those sections. So I was just explaining how if you're getting, your hair's too flat, change your part side, flip it to the other side, and you'll get some nice strength in there. Also, you Absorb to get rid of any of those yucky oils that might make your hair feel that little bit too flat. The other option is pre-dry uh, pre hair. So when you're drying your hair, say you want to part your hair on this side, okay? What you should do is with the hair dryer, blow it over onto that side of the hair. So get your hair dryer and smash the hair. You'll see the hair flying in this direction, okay? And then when you bring it back over, because you've given that root a little bit of air, when you bring it back over, you'll see that the body will come back into the hair. Okay, so another trick is change your part, one trick for more body, that's one way of doing it. Second opportunity is that you blow dry the opposite direction to where you want it to actually sit itself. We're talking all things body today. Now, now not everyone wants to have body, so this might not be the episode for you. But if you do, that's the best thing to do. Again, when applying the products, and I'm gonna talk about quicksand now. Now this stuff here, it's literally like a dust okay, in the hair, uh, a dust version of wax in the hair, okay? So imagine trying to get that wax that you have in a, in a, in a bowl and trying to put it into your root. It's messy, it's clunky, it's terrible, right? But the wax creates a great sticky feeling and really gets the roots to sit up behind, all right? And that's why this sort of product, which is in the dust, really can help you 
when you're trying to get that little bit more body in your hair. And again, you want to be dusting underneath the part of where you're going to be parting. Because there's no point in having all this dust on top when you're ready to style and you've got to try to get rid of it. You want to have it underneath. So when you bring the hair back and you're trying to create that little bit of body through that, through that region, you're going to get that quicksand to do all the work for you. The same thing applies with the sandstorm. Now, the difference between the sandstorm and the quicksand is probably the intensity of the product. This is going to give you a bigger hold and get you a better result, especially if you're backcombing the hair. This one is not going to have as strong a hold, but it's still going to give you a very good hold. But again, the same principles apply. If you're grabbing the hair and you want it parted on this side, you spray from underneath the opposite side of the hair, okay? You come in, you give it a good spray, that section, and then the next section underneath, and come underneath. Now, I just sprayed a whole bunch of stuff in, the, in her hair here, so she's probably gonna be a bit sticky, our wonderful dolly. All right, but you'll notice that I'll be able to detach her from here quite effectively. Now bring her up, all right? If I comb this hair up in this direction, then I just give it that little bit of a comb underneath here, okay? First section down. You'll see instantaneously this will get a bit, bit of volume. And you come in here and you do that again. Now dollies aren't like real hair, don't forget. It doesn't work in the same manner. You'll probably see a better result when you're getting it home, but you can see how much the hair has lifted up on this side. And all you can, you can see this side compared to this side, how flat it is, okay, and the difference. Now finally, on my final product is the thickening spray. For men that are out there, you have some issues, but even when you're styling uh, just a spiky sort of haircut and you're struggling to get it to last throughout the whole day with whatever product you're using, the thickening spray is amazing. You spray it into your hair beforehand and you'll see I'll try to get some spraying on, this, on, on the screen there, okay? Spray it onto your hair and dry it in, whether it's towel or with a hair dryer, and then you pop your product in, you'll see your hair last a very long time throughout the day. Best part about this product, especially for the blokes out there, is it smells amazing. So if you're going out, not that we can at the moment, but if you're gonna be going out and you wanna be smelling nice and fresh, this is great for you. Finally, also for women, same, same product. So these two products pretty much work in the same sort of way. They're both sprays, they both get into the hair, and they're both pre-drying off. Very important, you put them into nice wet hair, so you dry it into the hair, and you get the product to work really well in there for you. Again, the fragrance of this is amazing. You won't have to put any, um, any extra aftershave or perfume in that region at all. Um, I, we've known a few weird um, prime ministers that apparently like to, oh no, uh, presidents I should say, that like to whiff hair. Joe Biden I think apparently does. So um, the point is that if he wants to do something like that, it'll probably smell okay. So my suggestion is change the parting if you want a little bit more body. Second, make sure that you blow dry in the opposite direction that you want your hair to part in if you want extra body. And finally, apply the products in the wrong direction again before putting them into your, before finishing the styling of your hair. So you can get this sort of body compared to this sort of body. Enjoy everyone, stay safe, bye.